guys so today i'm gonna do a tutorial video on how to make a blowgun right so you guys stay tuned for that um i'm home at the moment i'm not doing any adventure in the forest or anywhere i'm doing it home here because while i was walking in my backyard a few days ago i saw some a certain creature on the tree which does sleep in the day right and come out at night i guess you can leave a comment below if you know what it is right but i'm gonna that that's gonna be the next video that i'll upload so i'm making the blowgun because i'll be needing that blowgun in the next video so i'll show you guys on how to make a blowgun so continue watching this video and you shall see so i'm gonna do that right now so keep watching and you'll see how to make a blowgun before i start this video on showing you guys how to make the blowgun i'd just like to inform you guys that this is not a weapon <clears throat> this is not a weapon to be playing with wild games and stuff right this is a weapon to catch like small game like birds lizard iguana and stuff right so don't use this against each other right don't play it because it can simply if someone blows that it can hit you in your eye and bust your eye it can damage yourself you can damage yourself and stuff don't play any wild game with this please if you are if you're gonna make one after I show you guys this video, don't play any wild game with it. It's very dangerous for a small weapon. So, here it goes. Look at this video and you shall see how to make a blowgun. So, what you will need is a copy book page, as you can see. Copy book page, Bristol board. You could use Bristol board if you want. Any hard cardboard you could get, you could use. Well, you need a scissors to cut the crystal board. Nails, the better nail will be a concrete nail, it will give you a much more better pump, yeah, and it's more tough. Well, scotch tape, well, I didn't have the roll, so I had to tape up some on a pencil, and of course, your PVC pipe. You could do the PVC pipe as long as you want, but I just use a half a meter, right? So, that is 50 centimeters. So, yeah, that is why I just use, right? So, as I go along, I'll show you guys what to do. So, this is all you need. Nothing much. Hey, guys. So, I'm going to look to cut up the copybook page right in square pieces so as you can see me doing right now i'm cutting them in square pieces you can't really cut them in rectangle because you'll not get the shape that you want so square pieces it could be four centimeter by four centimeter it could be five centimeter by five centimeter any how you want it once it once it's a square like shape right so that's what i'm doing now i got nine pieces so that's the first step in starting with the bullets my mistakes the bullets for the blowpipe so what you are seeing me doing right now i'm folding the square pieces of paper into a cone like shape right starting from end to end right and i'll put the scotch tape on it to hold hold it in the cone like shape as you can see i'm gonna demonstrate it for you all now cone like shape put the scotch tape and it will be like that so i'm gonna continue the rest for you guys and show you so right about now i'm gonna demonstrate to you guys how to put in the nail so i'm making the cone like shape right now right so you have to cut the top to make the the nail fit in as you can see how easy that was and wrap the scotch tape around the nail so the nail will not come out the nail will get enough tension to stay in the hole so that's what i'm doing 
I'm doing it with the fourth one that I am making. Cool, nice shape, pushing the nail. Cut the hole on top. You push in the nail. Make sure it's tight enough. Put some scotch tape to hold the nail in. And there you go with four bullets. So after continuing the steps of making the blowgun bullets, right? That was my last two that I was doing, right? As you can see, I'm tightening the nail on the bullet. So this is my last one that I am doing here right now. As you can see, cone like shape, scotch shape. Well, I have lost the scissors for a little bit, so I had to go and get the scissors, right? Cut the hole on top, push in the nail, right? You take some scotch shape again, tighten the nail on the cone like shape, shock there, and there you go, guys. 10 bullets finished. Okay guys, so what I'm gonna do now is measure the cone like shock there inside the pipe to make sure it fits right. So, all was a lay big, so I had to cut off on top, as you can see me doing right now. I'm gonna try it again to see if it will fit, but it was a little too big. So I tried it again, and perfect fit. So, I'm gonna do that for all the, all the other 9 bullets. Right, as you can see, push it in the pipe, make sure it fits right. If it doesn't fit right, you cut out the top, as you are seeing me doing right now. So, I'm going to do that for the rest. See, three, three bullets done. As you can see, I have finished all ten bullets, which is in my hand right now. And... All of them is perfect fit into the pipe. So what I'm gonna do now is try it out. So as you can see, I have 10 shots. Right, I'm a pipe to blow. So I'm gonna try it out now on on a tree. Right, don't mind the dogs in the background because right now I'm home. Right, so yeah, you'll be hearing plenty of that. Dogs and chicken. So yeah. So I'm gonna set up the target. Okay, so this will be my target. And I'll be shooting from over here. So as you can see my target.
so guys that's it um i finally finished make the blow gun as you can see in the um, practice that it was on target so i'm gonna show you guys what i really make the blow gun for so look out for that video within this week i might post it friday coming so just look out for that video but that's it there for the blow gun as you can see privacy pipes and bullets very easy to make hope you guys learn so you can try it but don't aim it at nobody else because it's a very dangerous weapon it can also bust your eye it can damage other people so just be careful with it when you guys make it right so yeah guys i'm out for until the other video hope you guys enjoy this video and if you haven't subscribed please go subscribe now and give me a like on my video so i hope you guys enjoy this tutorial video on how to make a blow gun right remember when making it please be careful on how you are how you are using it so i'm out until the next adventure i'll be posting the next video this week so you guys look out for that i'll be posting the video on what i have made the blow gun today for so please look out for that remember to always be with nature i'm out Blue face, baby.